Okay, folks, another symbol of money, money fucking. We'll soon find out what we're talking about. Though it doesn't have to be that way. Okay, let's see what we can do with this silly copier system. Um, Gonna drop the black out. I'm gonna have no black. It's gonna be stripped, as I like to call it. Don't know how it's gonna look. Okay, let's see what this is. It is a business tie. So a lot of businessmen love to be greedy. Anyway, it's just trying to see that lovely pattern. Yeah, there's a lot of greedy, most businessmen are, or business people, should I say, because there are women as well as men, but there are lots of greedy business people out there who just care about money and they don't care about the environment or the human race, and they put profit before everything else. And it really is disturbing. And this company here is no exception. Uh, the photocopier industry is full of cronies that love to fuck up the planet and rip people off. All in the name of making a fucking huge obscene profit. Now that looks really quite nice. I do think we could use that. So they want to make huge profits and they don't care about anything else but. And it is very, very, very disturbing to see even in Australia, we used to have a company uh, called Fuji Xerox. And now Fuji Xerox has been gobbled up fully by uh, Fujifilm. And they call it Fujifilm Business Innovation. And it just sounds like bullshit. And the ads on television are really shit. You just get, you get the feeling they don't... It's a cold company. Fujifilm Business Innovation, which is... Is, which is taking over from Fuji Xerox here in Australia. It has happened a while back, apparently. Well, what's going to happen to all the old Fuji Xerox um, photocopiers that no longer can be serviced because the spare parts are no longer available or they can't be interchanged with the Fujifilm uh, kit equipment? So I really am concerned. And you just get the feeling these companies like that just don't care. You just get the feeling they just want to make more profits than anything else. And you just it's just a cold company. I just get the feeling it's cold. Fujifilm is a cold company. It's not warm and inviting. It doesn't make you feel inspired. It feels cold. I don't like it. Unfortunately, I, I haven't got access to a Fujifilm uh, photocopier but I do think they do look from my experience they look like um, rebadged Hewlett Packard photocopiers or HP as it's now commonly it, it is now officially called so HP are not very good and they're flimsy and they're hard to use and it's just so evil there's just something evil about Fujifilm I don't like them. Um, that looks really quite nice. I think we could do more to it. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm just trying to see what section I can take out of this. I'm just intuitively guessing it's going to be there. But basically you just get the feeling that there's no warmth. There's no... It's all about making money. It's all about... They say things like it's... it's it's good for you, you, you can become a success. They're in, 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 implying that, they're saying that, you know, that it's key to success. They're printers, or they're photocopiers, whatever you want to call them, MFPs, MFDs, whatever, whatever the companies like to call them. Um, 
But basically, yeah, you just get the feeling that the company is just so fucking cold and uninviting. And it's really like... And the products are just shit. And they just keep advertising. It's all advertising shit. It's not real. It's not true. All It's like all the industry of... All the photocopy industry is run by assholes. There's no company that makes a photocopier that lives up to expectations. Most people hate photocopiers for that reason, that they don't work very well or they're hard to use. User unfriendly. Um, I don't know if I like that, um, but that looks like that could be the centre of the job. But you just get the feeling that the companies just don't care about, they don't have... What's the word? They just don't... They don't take pride in their work. That's the term I was looking for. They, take, they don't take pride in their work. You just get the feeling that it's just a cold, clinical, and yeah, cynical environment where money is God money is the ruler it's not to do with the product it's not to do with the people or the environment who gives a fuck when you can make from their point of view when you can make lots of fucking money and just fuck up everything and fuck the part fuck the money fuck everything money is God money is ruler money is master fuck that I'll tell you one thing folks I will be one day building a photocopier company folks and when I build my photocopier I'm going to make this company do the right thing I want to make it an environmentally and sustainable and a human race and a people friendly uh, company not going to build this shit that we have here in front of us or anywhere else we're going to make a difference and we're going to give most of the money away to science and humanity We've got to cut this climate change before it gets too much worse. And basically, yeah, we've got to change the world. We've got to change, truly change it. Not just talk about it, not just boast about it in, in slogans, advertising. We've got to make it real, folks. Real, true. Not pretend. Not just there to make, not saying it to make money, but to make a difference, folks. I'm passionate about photocopiers and it's going to show in my workmanship. Anyway, that looks really quite interesting. I think now we can call this demo quits.